Hi guys, Dr. Linda Kramer. Thanks for watching and today is a dream prophecy that I've had about Prince Harry. Okay, he is not in a good place at this point. Now, in this vision that I had, he's sitting on a chair and he's actually got his hands like this. And overbearing him is ta -ta -da -da, his wife. And she's virtually saying, you got to do this, yeah, da, 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 nitpicking him. So he's got his hands on there like this. And all I'm getting is this emotion from him of, oh my God, what have I put myself into? He is having some serious doubts about his what his options have been and the decisions he's made in the past. Now, something else that is going through his head at this point is his mother. We've got to remember here that Princess Diana was a divorcee with two young children. Do you honestly believe that she would want that for one of those two children to also grow up to be a divorcee with two young children? History never repeats. Ha ha ha. Or does it? So in this dream, this vision that I've had, he is now trying to salvage his own reputation here. He is scrambling and he's got a few options. One is to go back to America in exile with his wife, live there happily with his two kids. But I can tell you the future that I've seen there, it ain't going to go so well because he's going to lose his HRH title with that if he does that. Okay, so he'll only be Mr. Harry Windsor or Duke <laughs> instead of His Royal Highness. So that's one vision that I've had. If he stays in the UK, it's a long road to healing those fences that his or her, should I say her, has caused to fall down over the past few years. Even if he brought the two kids back to the UK and said, look at the, you know, these are the great grandchildren of the previous queen. They're now the grandchildren of the king. That ain't going to hold up in anyone's opinion of him. So he's in a dither. He's learnt the value of having those titles. And those that is in a nutshell, the protection services, the money, 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 money that he gets, and also the knowing that he's got access to everything else that the royals have got, including houses. Dum -da -da -dum. Okay, so Harry is on the move. That's what I'm seeing for the next couple of months. Harry is not going to be settling down anywhere. He's looking for options and he's scrambling at this point. I really do feel for the guy, you know. Oh my God. Even if you don't like the monarchy or you do like what they do, you've got to remember here something. They do a job and their job is to promote the good of others. That is why the monarchy exists. Here in Australia, we don't have anyone that's told, go and open that hospital, we'll film you doing it, so that hospital gets a lot of advertisement just because you're there. So it's these, what people would call selfless acts. We don't have it here in Australia. Monarchy in the UK, they have it. And when... You know, you look at like Princess Di when she went out to those minefields. She brought attention because of her public figure. She was there. And so many people then realized how many of those minefields were still out there injuring and killing children that were walking through those fields. So you've got to remember here, guys, there is good work that the royals do just because they are there. When Harry went over to Los Angeles, he's realized he doesn't fit in there because these are all wealthy people on their own merit. They didn't inherit the money like he has. So they 
don't like him that much because they are egotistical driven people themselves who want to make it in show business, who want to make it in book publications, go into movies, that sort of thing, which is now what he's trying to crack into. And do you think that these old ones that are doing it for years and years want him to come and invade their space? Uh, 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 uh. So there's a lot of pressure from the US where they're forcing him back to London to be where he used to be. Does this ultimately include Megan? Ooh. You're going to have to wait for the dream prophecy on her. Talk to you all again soon, guys. Hope you've liked this one. Bye.